Hi, this is Kyle from Inunday Development. This is our video tutorial on basic statistical functions. The 10v2 Cache Calculator app, like the physical HP calculator that inspired it, has a variety of statistical functions it can perform for you. If you haven't yet watched the video on the statistical entry screen, head over there now as it covers basic mechanics on how to get your statistical data points set up. Okay, so we'll set up similar data points to what we used in that video. Namely, 10, 10, 30, 11.2, 50, 14.7, and 70, 16. Now that I've got that set up, I hit done and head back to the main calculator. Half of the statistical functions are accessed by hitting the blue shift button and the others are accessed by hitting the orange shift button. Let's start out with the basic functions and I'll cover the more complicated ones in another video. First is n or number of data points. Hit blue shift n and we see that we have four data points. Next is sigma x or the sum of the x values. Hit blue shift, sigma x, and we see the sum of our x values is 160. Next, sigma y, which is the sum of the y values. Hit blue shift, sigma y, and we see that the sum of our y values is 51.9. Next is sigma x squared, which is the sum of the squares of the x values. Hit blue shift, sigma x squared, and I get 8400. And then sigma y squared, which is the sum of the squares of the y values. Hit blue shift, sigma y squared, and get 697.53. The last blue shift function is sigma xy, which takes each xy pair, multiplies them together, and adds the products. I hit blue shift, sigma xy, and get 2291. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions about this example, please feel free to email us at theteam at inadaydevelopment.com.